joining us once again. And um, Zach, you're here today to uh, talk about Wear Me Thin, which um, in a statement that you had sent to me earlier, it says that um, you explore themes of freedom, responsibility, and love with energetic piano-based Americana. Um, so how is um, uh, producing and writing um, this album, you know, different from them, some of your other work? Yeah, this one's been a really fun project. Um, this one was all recorded, uh, for the most part, live at Audio Atelier Studios uh, that Scott Helgerson has here in North Mankato. Um, so I worked with Ben Scruggs and Michelle Roche to rehearse all the songs, practice them, get them in really good shape, and then just re recorded them in one four-hour day. Wow. And then uh, we did a little more on top of that, uh, and I had Mel Murphy come and do some singing as well on the album. But it's just been a great experience to get this together. It's my debut EP, so I've released some singles before on my own, but to have something like this that's so professionally put together is really exciting. Congratulations. And you know, you. maybe for somebody who hasn't heard before, what kind of style of music do you like to perform? What can they expect with this album? Yeah, it ranges a bit, but definitely an Americana uh, vibe, rock and roll to a bit, but it, it's very singer-songwriter as well. There's some kind of ballad feels to it. Um, and the focus on this one was really all about the piano. I wanted to highlight mm. the piano playing. Wonderful. And so what would you say is your, um, was your biggest inspiration behind uh, the creation of this, this? Yeah, this one came together actually right around the time I was on this show last. Uh, I played at GSR on the piano and it was the first time I'd done a gig that was all piano. And something about some of those songs I put together just, I realized there was a narrative to tell mm. there that some of my songs I didn't even realize were kind of talking to each other and telling this story about, you know, love and, and what love really means and freedom and how to enter into a relationship where you are kind of free to love fully. And um, that sounds so great, Zach. <laughs> yeah. And so, uh, what are you going to be playing for us? So, I'm going to be playing a song now called Ill Behaved, which is going to be track number three on the album. All right, well, take it away, Zach. Thank you. Old news 
who's want to wake the world and I sing, bring them out whose blood we be drinking. Oh, we be drinking. Oh, we be drinking. Oh, we be drinking. And up next on Cato Living, we look over your Memorial Day and Memorial Weekend plans. Stay with us.